Now, your Super Doppler 10 forecast with meteorologist Casey Laheka. Well, good morning. We did have some storms roll through overnight, but that has since cleared out. Still dealing with a little bit of cloud cover out there. You can see the Lynn Haven Inlet camera right now, but we're off to a pretty mild start. Most areas are sitting into the upper 60s and low 70s. Now, the storms that we saw late last night are now off the coast. We don't have to worry about those, but they did bring some really heavy rain, some thunder, some lightning as well. But now that that's cleared out, high pressure is moving in, and that means we'll have some nice weather over the next couple of days. But everyone is dry. There isn't even a uh, lingering and light showers right now either. So not much to worry about there as you're heading out the door. 65 into Newport News and Wakefield. 68 as you're waking up in Suffolk and 65 for Saluda right now. 65 from Alpha, 70 into Norfolk and 68 for Chesapeake. Now the next couple of days, today, tomorrow are going to be right around average into the upper 70s. Average for this time of the year is 80 degrees. For Wednesday and Thursday, the heat and humidity returns will be into the upper 80s and even low 90s by Thursday. And then for Friday, we'll be into the mid 80s. So we are going to be dealing with a little bit more heat returning to the area for the second half of the work week. But here's where that drier air is, and that's where the cold front is. You can see dew points right now in Richmond, 54, while it's uh, 64 in a Suffolk. So the front is sitting right about there, and it will continue to slide off to the south and east. And that will bring us much more comfortable air for the next couple of days. Now, the wind is coming in pretty quickly, and that's because of that front that's moving through, coming in at about 510, even up to 15 miles per hour. So the rain has moved out. We have nothing to worry about through the rest of today. We'll have a lot of sunshine. It is going to be pretty breezy at times, coming in at about 510, even up to 15 miles per hour. And then for the day tomorrow, very similar conditions, with the exception of the wind not going to be quite as strong. And then Wednesday, the wind will be switching to come in from the south. That's going to bring us that warmer and more humid air but also some storms later into the afternoon and evening. So pretty much through the overnight, it looks like we'll see some rain later into the day on Wednesday into the early Thursday morning. It clears out, and then we'll see a little bit more sunshine moving through. Unfortunately, more rain returns later into the day on Thursday and then again for Friday. Now, I don't think every day is going to be a washout, but I do think there will be a little bit of rain across the region. So something to keep in mind, if you do have any outdoor plans, make sure you have the Wavy Weather app on your phone so you can check the radar in your exact location. And then continuing into Saturday and Sunday as well, we will have a few on and off showers. Now, your forecast today, 79 into Chesapeake, 77 into Norfolk and Portsmouth, and 78 for Suffolk. Along the peninsula, 75 Newport News, 75 into Hampton, and 78 for Williamsburg. We'll have a partly cloudy sky, uh, more cloud cover this morning, then clearing out into this afternoon after that front moves out. So your seven-day forecast here is what you can expect. Upper 70s for today and tomorrow. Overnight lows tonight will be into the mid to upper 50s, so very comfortable. You can give that air conditioning a break. And then for Wednesday on into Thursday, a little bit of rain moves through, but the heat, the humidity is returning right around 90 degrees by Thursday. And then we'll have more rain heading into the weekend, but we'll keep you updated on the timing of that always at wavy.com.